my name is Alan from Lanza Studios and I'm here today with a quick tip in Adobe Premiere Pro using Adobe Premiere Pro CC 2015. I was using 2015 the other day and I ran across a little issue and had to go digging online to find the solution. Um, however, the solution that I found was a bit incomplete. They didn't they didn't go into specifics like um, so I thought I'd do a video to try and help someone out there that's <clears throat> that's missing that step and not familiar with package content so here it goes um i was actually creating some lower thirds uh some title for a wedding video that i was editing and um i clicked on my templates like i normally do for cs6 and found out that it was actually missing all of these templates were missing so i can't really work without my templates because now i'm not a master designer so i need help so i started panicking so i went online like i said found the solution and um was able to complete it so you need to go online and get the functional content i'll provide this link below so i'm on a mac so i downloaded the, the mac 1.1 gigabyte worth of uh functional content and install it for cs6 i know some of you guys don't have cs6 but you can if you have subscription to um, creative cloud you can you actually have free access to cs6 so uh, don't worry about that you have it even though you may not have it installed so install cs6 and if you're pressed for space uninstall it once you're done with this process uh once you install it click on cs6 um, um go to the applications folder click on adobe premiere pro cs6 um this is what it installed the presets all these styles templates and textures so you can actually copy this presets folder the entire folder and we can paste it in uh, CC 2015, or you can just copy all three of these folders and paste it because see, uh, 2015 ha have a uh, presets folder. It's just a bit hidden if you're not used to package content, like I said. So here's how we get the package content. Right click on the icon, click on the, first of all, click on the Adobe Premiere Pro CC 2015 folder. Uh, right click on the actual application icon, show package contents and click on contents and voila there's the presets folder so you can actually if you if you copy the entire presets folder paste it if you didn't if you just copy the three paste it in here um now before i did this there was already a styles folder in here so what i actually did was merge it so and voila that's it so if you had adobe premiere pro cc 2015 already open close it reopen it and you should see all of these like i'm seeing here all right, hopefully this tip was helpful, guys. Take care. If you have any comments or questions, just leave them below, and um, I'll be happy to answer anything that I can. Okay, guys, take care, and have a good one. Bye.